हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू सॉल्व दिस नाइस मैथ ओलम्पेड अलजबरा प्रॉब्लम सो हेयर वी हैव अ नाइस रेडिकल इक्वेशन इफ वी हैव स्केयर रूट ऑफ एक्स माइनस सेवन इज इक्वल टू स्केयर रूट ऑफ एक्स माइनस सेवन एंड वी सॉल्व दिस प्रॉब्लम फॉर द वैल्यूज ऑफ एक्स सो हेयर इन ऑर्डर टू फाइंड द वैल्यू ऑफ एक्स फर्स्ट वी नीड टू रिमूव दिज रेडिकल साइंस फ्राम बोथ ऑफ द साइड्स so that in order to remove this radical signs first we need to take the squaring on both of the sides so when we take squaring it will be written as square root of x minus 7 whole square is equals to uh, square root of x minus 7 and its whole square so you see here uh, this square is cancelled out by this square and now here in the left hand side we use this nice algebraic formula you know about that if we have a minus b whole square is equals to a square minus 2 times of ab plus b square and you see here this is the value of a and this is the value of b so uh, here according to these two values of a and b have we put these two values into the uh, into this formula and according to this formula we expand uh, this term as first you have a square here our a is x square root and its whole square minus 2 times of ab so here our a is square root of x and b is 7 plus b square b is 7 square is equals to so this 2 and this square root are gone and we get here x minus 7 and now further in the next step we need more simplification and this 2 and this square root are gone and we get here Uh, x minus this is two times of seven becomes fourteen times of square root of x and plus this seven square is equals to forty nine and here we move these two terms in the left hand side uh, so this is the plus x when we move here it will becomes minus x this is minus seven when we move in the left hand side it will becomes plus seven and this whole equation is equals to zero. and now in the next steps we need to add or subtract the like term so you see here this is the positive x and negative x are gone and we get here uh, here we get this is minus 14 times of uh, square root of x plus this is 49 plus 7 is equals to 56 and this whole equation is equals to 0 so now in the next step uh here we uh, you see that again we have the square root of x is lies here so that now we need to eliminate this square root sign for this we move all the other terms to the right hand side uh, so here first we move this plus 56 to the right hand side and it will be written as minus 14 times of square root of x is equals to minus 56 and uh, here in in order to uh, eliminate this minus 14 Uh, we need to divide both of the sides by minus 14 okay so when we divide each of these terms by minus 14 it will be written as minus 56 divided by minus 14 so you see here this minus 14 and this minus 14 are gone and in the left hand side we will get square root of x is equals to this minus and this minus are gone and we get here this is 14 times of 4 becomes here 56 so here we get only 4 so uh, in the next steps uh, in order to uh, remove this square root sign uh, we need to again take the uh, squaring on both of the sides uh, so here we again take squaring on both of the sides and it will be written as square root of x and its whole square is equals to 4 square So further, you see here this two and this square root are gone, and we get here our x is equals to this four square is equals to sixteen. So this shows that uh, x equals to sixteen be the uh, only one uh, root of the given equation. So uh, here because our given equation is a radical equation, uh, so here we need to verify our this solution or this root, and we check that. is this root or uh, is satisfied our given question statement or not or in other words here we can uh, check that is this solution or is this extraneous root okay so for this we need to verify so first we copy down our given question statement here it is square root of x minus 
is equal to square root of x minus 7. And now here in the steps, uh, in the next steps, we need to verify this value and now we put uh, this 16 on both of the sides and we verify that is both of the sides are equal or not. So when you put this value here, it will become square root, uh, square root of 16 minus 7 is equals to square root of this is x minus 7 and this will become 16 minus 7. And now here in the next step, we easily take, uh, we easily find the square root of this 16. Uh, so we know that a square root of 16 is equals to 4 minus 7. And here when we subtract the so 16 minus 7 is equals to square root of 9 and here we have 4 minus 7 is equals to minus 3 and here we see that the square root of 9 is equals to plus 3. So here you see that minus 3 is not equals to plus 3. So this means that uh, the value of our x is equals to 16 is not satisfied our given question statement. So here we just write that it is uh, not satisfied our given question statement. And we know that if the value of this x is not satisfied our uh, given question statement, this means that uh, this is the our uh, extraneous root. Okay, here we can just say that x equals to 16 be the uh, extraneous root. So, if this is extraneous root, it means that this equation has uh, no solution. Okay, because this is the extraneous root, so our given equation has uh, does not have a solution. Or, in other words, we can say that this equation has no solution. So, uh, this is the our final answer. And thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos.